Tunisia. Live. Be informed. Be involved. Another party has achieved the highest position nationally and in all constituencies. Before the official results of the first Tunisian fair and democratic elections were announced, Ennahda, Tunisia's Conservative Party, already claimed victory. As the count is still underway, people started speculating and leaks filled papers and airwaves. But the elections committee refrained from announcing any partial results and only overseas votes results were released. Overseas, Ennahda obtained 9 seats of the 18 seats representing Tunisians abroad, followed by Congrès pour la République and the Takatur. Supporters came to celebrate in front of another headquarters, and we saw similar joyful scenes in the headquarters of Congrès pour la République and the Takatu. But at the highest level of these parties, leaders started thinking about the composition of the new government. An option proposed and likely to be accepted by the three major parties is a government of national unity. It's not interested in monopolizing, dominating or governing on its own, no. And now that has said it time and time again that it, it's, it's looking for a national coalition, a broad national coalition, uh, in order to rise up, be able to meet those huge challenges facing Tunisia today. The results show Tunisia is more conservative than many had predicted. The question is where is the Tunisian left wing? Parties like the PDP, PDM are no longer present in the new electoral map of the country. Will these parties ever be able to regain the voters they have lost? Tunisia. Live. Be informed. Be involved.